Uh, gray unions are moving toward consolidation, as well as some of the leagues. Um, and is that going to be good for the industry in the long run? I would like to say that I would love all credit unions to, to maintain their current charters and their business. The reality is, world's changing. Uh, field sponsors are going away. Smaller credit unions have some difficulty in, in providing all the product. Larger credit unions, there's some attractiveness today uh, to merge, to really gain some economies in, in broaden field of membership. But again, I really hope that through collaboration and cooperation, we can create systems that credit unions that have the want, the desire, and the ability to remain viable will have that environment. Now, you've talked a lot about collaboration, and you hear from both sides that collaboration is better and stronger, so where credit unions are going to survive. Others have said, we need to compete, we need to be financial services institutions first. Um, do you feel there is a loss of that, that cooperative spirit? And if so, how are credit unions going to regain it or use it to their advantage in the long term? I think for a period of years, uh, when field membership started opening up and we had lots of community charters and overlapping, uh, we got to feel we were competitive. We are not, we're not big enough to say that our competition is one another. I think through this financial crisis, credit unions realize that being cooperative and working together is the only thing that makes us survive. And I see a renewed sense of that. That, that cooperation, and I think that uh, we all know we need each other. The system is interdependent, mm -hmm. and when you make a loan uh, or you lose a loan, it also impacts me. Right. And <clears throat> we just need to get back to really talking about how we can cooperate and make each other stronger instead of worrying about uh, competing in a very small market when we've got a large market when we only have 6% market share. Absolutely.